girls! Today I'm going to be making a video on this look. And it's just a really plummy, purpley fall look. And I thought it was really nice with really um, contoured blush cheeks, not necessarily contouring powder. What you're going to need for this tutorial is, well you don't necessarily need it, you're going to need plum colors. I used my Naked palette and my Tarte Royal palette because they both have very nice neutral and plum colors. So keep watching if you'd like to see more. Thanks, guys. Okay, so the first thing you're going to do is you're going to start by priming your eyes. I'm just using the Urban Decay Primer Lotion. I'm just going to put this all over my lids. All over your lids. I'm going to pull my hair back. It's not doing it for me. Okay, so the next step, you're going to be taking a purple eyeliner. This is just the one that I'm going to be using. This is Wet n Wild Purple, or 650D, depending on what you're looking at. And it just looks like this. It's a really nice purple color. I'm going to be putting this on my outer corner, more so in the crease than anything. You can be really messy with, well, not super messy with it. But you don't need to worry about like precision because you're going to be blending this out with your fingers anyways. But make sure you put enough in that you have enough to blend out. So this is what mine looks like. They're both kind of different. And then I'm just going to be blending down and out. This is going to add a little bit of an extra base for the shadows I'm going to be putting on my lid. Once you have that, you're going to go in with your Naked palette, and I'm going to be using the color Sin, which has a very pink undertone. I'm taking a flat brush, this is just a crown brush, and I'm going to go in with Sin. If you don't know what Sin looks like, it's this color right here. You can find a dupe for it really easily. Um, I'm sure Wet n Wild or MAC has dupes for this color. So. I'm going to be packing this all over my lid. Okay, and if you notice, I'm not looking at the camera. My mirror's behind the camera, so I'm trying to get my lines accurate. Okay, next I'm going to go in with a pencil brush, and I'm going to be taking Hustle, which is this plummy purple color, which is right here. And this is my pencil brush. This is also from Crown Brushes. And I'm... Actually, no, first I'm going to go in with Toasted. I pointed to the wrong color. Toasted, which is the plummy color right next to it, plum pink color. I'm going to be putting this in my crease. So once you have that, you're going to go in with a blending brush, and this is the blending brush that I am using. I'm just going to blend this out. You could leave the look just like this if you wanted to wear it to school or work and just add a brow bone highlight like I'm about to. And then that could just be your overall look for the day with some mascara. But if you're going to wear it out at night like I am, you can go in with Hustle which is right next to it, which I already showed you. This color right here. And you can deepen up your outer V with this. So how I do it is I just draw a very small triangle, like so, in my outer corner, and I drag it out to the edge and bring it into my crease a little bit. Now I'm going to go back in with my pencil brush and put a highlight in the inner corner, too. You can use any highlight color that 
you want. I'm just using Virgin from the Naked Palette, which is the first lightest color. And then I'm going to go in with my Tarte Palette. And they have this really deep plum purple, which is right here. It's very similar to Hustle. If you don't have the Naked Palette, you could easily do this look with the Tarte Palette as well. But I'm going to go in with this on the um, pencil brush as well and just place it over this and bring it down on the lash line. I'm going to go back in with my pink color, which is thin, and touch up my lid. And then go back in with Toasted and just warm it up one more time. So once you have this blended out like so, you can go in with your mascara and your liner, and I will be right back after I do this. Okay, so now once you have your mascara done, I just used a plum eyeliner. You could use black if you want, but I went for the more subtle plum liner. I'm going to go in with my e.l.f. duo with the contouring and the blush powder. I'm sure you've seen this. Terrible to the Laguna and Orgasm. And I'm just going to go in with the blush. I'm not going to be using, con I'm not going to contour my face today. But I'm going to suck in like I'm going to contour. And then put it where, the line where I would make my bronzer and my contour powder meet. That's done. I'm going to go into my favorite lip gloss of the moment, which is Princess. And it's an Ulta lip gloss. It's a lip gloss duo. Once you have that, you can go in and highlight if you would like. You don't have to if you don't want to. And this is the finished look. So I hope you guys liked this quick little fall tutorial. It's definitely more for a night out, and it's much more dramatic. But, um, yeah. So thank you guys for watching, and subscribe and comment. And I'm really happy to be making videos again. So there should be more up soon. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.